Scorpios. Thank you so much for tuning in. Let's get started. Let's see what we get. Remember, it's not a personal reading. It's a general reading. And the rules, I mean, this could also be a prediction. Okay? So let's get general energy for Scorpios. If you want to skip over to the you versus me reading, you can. You versus them. Sorry, I keep saying that. Um, Scorpios. What do we have for Scorpios, for guys? Whoa. Okay. Savage. <laughs> Try a different approach. Um, change your outlook, your opinion, point of view, your point of view, your perspective here needs to be changed, maybe. Um, yeah, because maybe you're coming off a little too savage, <laughs> too ruthless, um, getting what you want, not giving a care, <laughs> don't hold back, tough skin, confident, a badass here. But I feel like... You're needing to change your perspective, your point of view. Maybe there is an, maybe you are not wanting to see somebody else's perspective. Let's see. Let's see what it is. Give me some more on Scorpio. Okay. I feel like you're avoiding something here and you don't even care you're you're needing to really change your way of thinking because maybe there is something something you're avoiding and you don't even yeah you don't even care <laughs> okay give me more of this savage You're making somebody feel um, rejected. Yeah. It could be maybe somebody here that has betrayed you and you're not even caring anymore. Somebody, uh, of course, made you feel rejected. Um, or, I'm not trying to make this about love, but it could be. It could be also being betrayed by someone and not even caring anymore maybe this person is trying to come towards you but they feel like maybe you're just going to be very blunt about things not caring and just tell them off or something like that somebody here wants to reconcile meaning mend something that went bad between you two could be with friends family anybody here but or at home basically yeah I feel like somebody here has done you wrong and you really don't care right now. You're not even going to hold back on your words or you probably didn't hold back. Or they're probably scared of coming towards you because you're trying to avoid them. It's like, no, why am I going to, why am I going to try? Why am I going to try? That's the kind of thing I'm getting from you. It's like, it's done. It's a done deal. It's, and that's it. You've probably been healing from it. Been probably focused on work. Mm -hmm. I don't know. That's what I'm feeling. Let's see. Oh, wrong deck. What do we have for Scorpios here? Why do they have a point of view? For Scorpios. But as uh, Scorpios, I feel like you're acting out of hurt, to tell you the truth. Like maybe you, I don't know. That's what I'm feeling. So we have stripped down. Strip away your armor and come to know the very parts you've hidden away. Wipe this state slate clean and give yourself permission to write a new beginning and ultimately a new story. Yeah, you're needing to work on your confidence or work on yourself. 
something here has kind of um, put you in a state where you're you have like an armor of course like you don't want to be be done wrong again mm-hmm let's see wipe the slate clean and give yourself permission to write a new beginning okay so maybe you're still maybe you're trying to avoid s something or someone or uh, because you don't feel like you you can forgive them or you can even you can forgive the person but you don't have to you know live with them or be around them but maybe there is something here that you are acting out of um fear it could be hurt most of all hurt mm -hmm. so give me more on scorpios their advice what they need to know now create an altar hmm. create a sacred space to help you manifest your intentions maybe you're needing to you know just have your own space so you can also have somewhere to go in maybe you know set your intentions start manifesting you could even it could it could just be your space you don't have to create an altar if you don't believe in that but you it could just be your your space meditate you know heal from something i feel like there needs to be some healing focus on some healing and have patience with yourself okay so let's get into new love any new love for scorpios for them? dress to impress an option mm. physical attraction okay dress to impress i want to look so good you won't be able to resist me <laughs> I'm dating someone else, but I like you too. I can't decide who I want. Physical attraction. I love all your curves. You're my definition of perfect. So I feel like somebody here does feel a pull towards you. Maybe you've been dressing to impress them or you've been trying to... I don't know, but this person does have ap uh, options. Okay, let's look into it. Give me more on dress to impress for Scorpios. Okay, so I feel like someone here has been kind of thinking about taking action towards you. They find you very attractive, Scorpio. But this person could also be have a couple options or someone else. Give me more of this options. Mm-hmm. Yeah. This person could cause a burden on you. So if you give them a chance, they could be emotionally immature. Um, I feel like you're more focused on yourself right now. You're trying to just uh, focus on uh, other things. You know, you're thinking more logically here. You're also seeing if this person is even, you know, worth the time, the effort, I feel. I feel that's what you're thinking. Mm-hmm. Because you're looking at them like, no, I don't know about that. Yeah, they could have a lot going on. Give me more of this physical attraction. Yeah, there is physical attraction between you two. Uh, the tower wanted to come out, so you probably have already... Yeah, you know what it is, though. And you're kind of blocking it out, like saying, nope. I don't think so okay I don't want something casual and they probably have too much on their on their hands anyway so you just want something you just don't want the casual the ace of wands is 
something phallic of course so you might see that and you're kind of thinking it thinking about it twice they find you very attractive they want to reach out to you okay so but you can also be an option and you know that okay so that is what i have for you next up actually let me say the signs we have sag air signs water could be a gemini um lots of fire aries gemini virgo aquarius okay so that is what i have um next up if you're still interested in your past love we have a you versus me okay so if not it's it's okay take care of you and thanks again bye hi scorpios thank you so much for tuning in let's get started remember it's not a personal reading it's a general reading and the roles can be reversed let's see what do we have for scorpio the roles can be reversed because the goal here is to get some insight and advice. So let's see Scorpios. What do we have with Scorpio's energy towards this person? Hmm. Completion. Okay. We have completion. So Scorpio, you've you feel like you are you're done you're going towards your abundance you are blocked blocking love okay feel like you're you're just wanting to be happy now you're protecting your heart um or you're just trying to work on yourself ascension Ooh, you got really good cards well you know um this is somebody person i'm picking up here or the group i'm picking up is someone that is just wanting to take care of themselves ascending you know like you are a whole new person here <laughs> you actually just want to be happy now you're working on that but there could be some insecurities i feel like again with your arms on your chest here um you're getting over something you don't want to be hurt again you want to mm, focus on you on your health your money your stability your security your mind body and soul but you're having trouble with that um for some of you for others of you of course that could have been you know you in in the past and you are reaching a sense of completion like oh i'm finally freeing myself i'm finally feel like i'm over this let's see what is this person's energy towards scorpio okay this person's energy towards scorpio square lines Wow, um, Pisces just got that. Lust. Reconciliation. Wow, you don't know this, Scorpio, but this person is actually in a whole different um, energy than you. I feel like you're ascending here. You're leveling up. You are... But this person lusts over you. They think about you a lot. They fantasize about you. They they want reconciliation here with you. I don't know if you're there anymore. I feel like you're blocking yourself from this. Holding on. See? They're holding on to you. At the bottom of the deck for them. So, let's see. You don't feel really abundant because this is at the the root of your issue here so i feel like you're working on it though let's see what is this completion for scorpio give me more of this completion for scorpio wow high priestess yeah there is something in your intuition right now that is telling you you are free i keep hearing you're free my dear it's interesting i don't really talk like that Let's see, give me more on this high priestess and completion. 
something i feel like it's past karma oh wow i have reversals in here i don't usually have reversals but yeah look at that could be my only reversal interesting how that came out reversed you're getting out of heartbreak you're freeing yourself from hurt pain interesting okay anyway so i do feel that you are getting out of this you're getting you're freeing yourself from painful memories painful thoughts something that really hurt you like to the core there is some um, past life karma that you're freeing yourself you've completed it's time for you to level up it's um yep what is this abundant why is it at the root of the issue yeah you're wanting to move forward you're trying to really yeah really fill your cup up focused on you on your own love self-care self self-love and you're working on it i feel because you will just want to move move forward give me more of this ascension what's this ascension Okay, that one just popped out um so this person wants to come back around because you are leveling up they see you as um i feel like this person is actually wanting to offer you something stable secure something long term so the engagement ring the they see you as their soulmate but they also see you that you're moving moving on like you're leveling up you're glowing here it could be as well but what this person sees is your back that's why they re want to reconcile that's why they're ready because they feel you detaching they feel you freeing yourself okay so let's see give me more of this ready for a scorpius person person on this thing about what's this ready about oh yep look at that they're ready to invest in this. They want to come towards you with a nice gesture. They want to invest. Mm -hmm. it could be a Pisces or have Pisces in their chart. Or Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Let's see. Give me more of this lust. They fantasize about you. Oh, yeah. They're making a... A decision here um, they have been thinking a lot about this they want clarity they want a decision it's interesting because we have less they actually think a lot about you um, they fantasize about you but they're also I'm feeling a sense of contemplating you know should I should I not maybe I should um, I don't know should i come back around should i make this decision of settling down uh, that's the kind of vibe i'm getting here they don't know if it's lust they don't know i don't know i feel like it's mercury retrograde that's what it is <laughs> let's see give me more of this justice and ju judgment i feel like it's contemplation they don't know what to do they should come back around yep they don't know if it's love or lust or if they want commitment. Um, I see a marriage here. They don't know if this has a chance for like marriage. They're actually thinking about marriage. Their problem is that they can't really fully commit for some reason. They wanted to keep it at a, you know, lust level. And now they know that they need to level up. They're feeling that pressure to make that decision over a commitment, a label, to label this connection. Or why am I getting label? It's interesting. <laughs> but for some of you, of course, having that traditional exclusive relationship. And they, they really wanted just uh, something casual for some of them. But now they're feeling that pressure of needing to make it something 
because they see you walking away they see you freeing yourself leveling up give me more of this reconciliation and now they want to come back around see they're confused they're emotionally confused because they feel out in the cold by you and they just want to be like this, this person feels like just not thinking about it anymore and just going for it i feel like i just need to do it because i feel like this person also gets uh, frustrated so they want to come towards you yep look at so many nights and the problem is that they're not coming towards you they need to take that action and they know they know they do and really quickly they know that they have to do it sooner than later because they're feeling that pressure let's see what we'll gets let's get into their thoughts this person can feel you detaching mm -hmm. let's see What is um, this person thinking about, Scorpio? See? Love offer. <laughs> Foolish. Yeah. There's no... There's not really a king here, so... They could be a little bit um, on the younger side. It doesn't have to be, but... Mm, look at that. Again, Pisces got that, too. The deception card regrets okay so they they're feeling empty without you right now what is this deception i feel like they're just not telling you about their love for you or yeah they're blocking themselves from this give me more of this or they probably yeah they're having regrets and they're not telling you about it that's what it is that's the deception. It's like um, they're not lying, but they're keeping it from you, which kind of really does make it a lie because they're not being upfront with what they're feeling. Their regrets. We have regrets here twice. So we have love offer. Is your heart open to receive my love offer? Foolish. I lack the maturity to handle a person like you see so they know that you're a lot more yeah you bring more to the table they're a little bit in the on the immature side that's why we have lust here but they don't know if you're open to their love offer we have deception i lie to you because i'm afraid of the choices you'll make so if they lie to you that they um how do I say this person is actually if they tell you that they do have feelings for you or they don't have feelings for you they could be lying because they're feeling regretful or they're probably also don't want to tell you that they're feeling regretful because then you'll be more like I told you you know or they'll feel foolish because of the actions that they did towards you you know they'll feel like see I, I told you to listen to me now that you want you know they don't want to feel stupid okay <laughs> regrets I regret the things I should have done but never did see I feel like this person just feels like it's an ego thing you know they don't want to feel like that and nobody does actually you know finally you wake up and you realize wow I shouldn't have done that or wow I shouldn't have said that I've had those moments where I'm like I'm an air saying I say things without even thinking sometimes so I'm like wow I shouldn't have said that <laughs> you know like so you know they're probably there too let's see let's get more into their thoughts okay uh, are this person's thoughts towards Scorpio Okay, 
I feel butterflies when I'm around you. You're very intimidating. My heart still feels heavy at this moment. Please be patient with me. Interesting. So, I feel like this person... I don't know if this person fell in love with you. Or they just feel the pressure. Like, okay, I'm ready. I need to do this. They're going to come at you that way. But right now, they need patience. They, they're going to crack. It kind of seems like they're going to crack. They're not going to take this anymore. Like this confusion, this um, being outside in the cold. And they're going to want to just come towards you out of nowhere without even thinking and, and saying something. But you intimidate them. Because you're, I feel like you're just leveling up. And they're really in the same place, like where you left them or, you know, they really, you really do intimidate them, okay? They need patience because they can't really come at you with what they're really feeling. This person could just be in their feels, okay? So I don't see any real love here. It, there is a love offer, but for some of you, you need to use discernment. It really does depend. Maybe you were in a marriage with them, so there could be love. But for others of you, this person could be lying about their love offer. So use discernment, okay? Because it's going to be different for everyone. I don't want to mislead anybody, okay? But I feel if you're a Scorpio over here, you're, you know best. You know best because I feel like you're leveling up. You are really focused on you. And that and they feel that. That's why they feel intimidated. Okay. Advice for the person watching this. Realize. Whoa. Okay. Okay. So let yourself be vulnerable. There's beauty in every single human emotion. And those brave enough to let themselves feel things in front of your person. Mm, honor your feelings. Okay. So I feel like maybe you're blocking your emotions here. Because you're trying to just get level up. I feel like this is not really for you. It's really for them. That they need to be vulnerable. I don't know whoever is watching. Because this is actually for the one that is watching. This is advice. So letting yourself be vulnerable. If you still want this. Mm -hmm. Okay. So because this person over here. They are in regret over you. For some of you. You were in a marriage with them. Okay, because I do see marriage. So, let's see what do we have here. I have a uh, Pisces, Taurus, um, Sag, Scorpio, Cancer, Air Signs, Libra, Taurus, Water, Earth, Air, Gemini, mm, Water, Pisces, Earth. Yep, that is what I have. Fire. I have Earth here again. Fire. See, Gemini or Virgo. Somebody needs to take action. Yeah, there could have been a family here. There probably could be family involved or a problem here too. Okay, so that is what I have. Thank you so much for watching and I'll be back later. Take care of you. Bye.